Good morning. Today is Thursday, May 16, 2024, and this daily bread is titled, Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. It's from John 14, verses 1 to 6. The key verse is verse 6, and it says, Jesus answered, I am the way, and the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Do not let your hearts be troubled. You believe in God, believe also in me. My Father's house has many rooms. If that were not so, would I have told you that I am going there to prepare a place for you? And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come back and take you to be with me, that you also may be where I am. You know the way to the place where I am going. Thomas said to him, Lord, we don't know where you are going. So how can we know the way? Jesus answered, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Daily Bread Part 1 Trust in Jesus as the ultimate comforter. Jesus reassures his disciples during a time of confusion and fear, reminding them to trust in him just as they trust in God. He promises that he is preparing a place for them, which is also a promise for us, our eternal home with him. When we feel anxious or unsure about our future, whether it's about exams, relationships, or career paths, that's when we must turn to Jesus in prayer. Philippians 4, 6-7 says, Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your request to God, and the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Turning to prayer and the Word of God strengthens our faith and helps us find peace in Jesus' promises. Let's spend time each day holding firm to His Word to stay grounded in Him, and He will free us from any worry. Part 2. Jesus as the only way to God. Jesus boldly declares, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. This teaches us that true guidance, life, and salvation are found only in Him, not in worldly wisdom or other spiritual paths. In the world, we are surrounded by diverse beliefs and knowledge. Our daily struggle is to confidently affirm our faith in Jesus as the only path to God. Instead of turning to the world, we should prioritize studying the Bible, seeking clarity from other believers, and attending Sunday services. Joshua 1.9 says, Keep this book of the law always on your lips. Meditate on it day and night, so that you may be careful to do everything written in it. Then you will be prosperous and successful. Jesus is our ultimate guide, truth, and source of life. As we keep seeking Him, He will help us to solidify our faith and live it out authentically. Let's pray. Father, thank you for the assurance that you are my way, my truth, and my life. Please strengthen my faith, especially when things feel uncertain. Help me focus on the eternal home you're preparing for me and give me the courage to live according to your word. I want to boldly proclaim that you are my only way. In Jesus' name, amen. One word, Jesus 
is my way, my truth, and my life.